Hello anyone and everyone, welcome to Edral Plays. Around with his stuff, because he needs to pull up the right window. Boom, boom! Garrison Archangel. Uh, developed by Indigo Entertainment, published by Indigo Entertainment. Came out May 15, 2020. That's surprising. 2020 or 2021? Hold on, let's go to the store page, just to re... Uh, yeah, it's May 2020. Surprised that this game isn't well known. This is a... This is a gem, in my opinion. Um... Boom, this game just recently came out early access. I tried the demo before I played it. I did do a demo days on it, and then I found out I loved it. Then last night, me and my friend played it, because normally I like to go into videos, you know, blind. Or not really blind, but, like, gen genuine first impressions. That's usually what I go for, what I strive for. But for this one, since I played the demo first, and I didn't record that, I figured that even just doing a first impressions is sort of disingenuous to like try and go in there and be whoa this is wacky so uh last night when i got it my friend wanted to play we played the multiplayer which they say is peer-to-peer -peer because it's still in beta which it is kind of clunky and bleh, but it's still pretty fun uh right now we'll just jump into the single player mode i haven't really uh, i haven't done missions or that we're just gonna jump into the arcade but uh archangel is a uh, you know, let's do the proper thing. It is currently $14.99 US dollars on Steam. Uh, Garrison Archangel is a fast-paced, customizable mech fighting game designed for epic anime-style one-on-one multiplayer team battles. Design, build, and pilot your own Archangels today. Gives me hardcore armor core vibes. I know it has more of a combat game. Nope, no, 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 not missions, not mission, not mission, not, no, 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 no. What, what is this? Maybe I should do the mission, because that's actually a first impression for me, in hindsight. So, you know, what, what, we'll do the, we'll, look, first let's do a little go over the glossary thing. So, you know, this is the game, these are your mechs, the real creme de la creme, the garage, which is very armor core-esque. Now, here are your generic robots that you got, and they all have, like, you know, various stats, which is very cool, you know what I mean? Like, I'm not trying to hate on it. But then you got this guy that I made, which was my first one that I messed up, messed around with, that came, that I made in the demo. Uh, which is just this thing, but like worked on. And then you got the Siege Bot, which is just all rockets, all the time. You got Drillbert, who I won the demo with, with in the arcade, and I made him look as intimidating as possible. You got Spinner, who's a funny concept. This thing has crossbow bolts, and the Pink Ranger has fists. Let's try it out. Let's jump into some games. I, I haven't done any of the. Arcades, so defeat multiple enemies and see how long you can last. Let's do an arcade match, you know? We did normal already. We really beat it, so let's do it again. I'll do it again just because I want to get my butt kicked on a video, right? I played this bot where I made Pink Ranger. I didn't really get to test him out. Sakura Storm. You look intimidating, but I look like a Gundam with big fists. You got your fancy glows, you got your fancy Sakura. Storm, and then you get your sword. Ooh, what are we fighting? All right, let's do this round one. I was charge up my hand. Charge up my burning hand. Right, let's punch this guy in the face. Oh, we're just getting the shit shot of us. Hold on, hold on. Just punch him. Okay, we're getting we're getting beat up. We're getting we're getting the crap beat out of us. If you can't tell, if it isn't obvious what's happening on the screen, I'm just trying to throw hands, and I'm. Got slapped! Holy shoot! Thank God we played normal, right? All right, come on, Pink Ranger. You got these hands for a reason. All right, now we got that fixed. All right, he's just shooting us before. All right, see, the issue is he's he's smart. He's swinging at us with his sword before we can get into uh, proper fist range. And we're getting our asses whooped for it. Why am I not left clicking? Sir, 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 this is a Wendy's. Alright. <laughs> we got stomped pretty bad there. But we're gonna retry that because I don't know. Feels like my left hand wasn't wasn't throwing out the jabs. Maybe we're not gonna charge up our fist. Let's just rush this dude. Yeah, that's it. Just punch him. Just just assault him. Just get up. Get up so you can get the punch on, huh? Sorry, this is very anime. Oh, shit. He's beating the crap out of me. Oh. So basically what happens is when you're using your boost and you're getting hit a lot, you see that you have a stability bar above our health in the bottom left. 
when you get too dis uh, too not stable from either A, your own advanced fucking movements, or B, getting thrashed around. Yeah, you're bo boosting too hard. Oh my god! Alright. Yeah, we gotta shut the finger. This is the one, this is the last one we made before we went to bed. Even though that one gray looking bot is very generic. I made the, that one and this one right before I went to bed. Come on, Starfist. Come on, Starfist! Boom! Okay, I think I knocked him away with some type of super punch, and I kind of love it. Charge up my Starfist. Star charge up the Starfist all the way. I right, gotta make sure we don't get hit by whatever laser barrage he's doing to me. Hit him with the normal small fist. Hit him with the left fist. Then we hit him with the right fist! Ooh, baby! Ooh, baby, it's a triple. Oh, baby! Stop, stop, stop! We gotta kill him. We gotta kill him before we die. That's that's how fighting games work. We gotta kill him before he. Is this what you want? Are you trying to tell me the Pink Ranger isn't ready for this fight? No. Hey, welcome to Ed Troll Plays. Getting his ass kicked by uh, <laughs> the first bot in the arcade ladder, Sakura Storm. Come on. Let's charge up the fist. Charge up the fist. I don't care. Let's charge up both fists. We're gonna charge up both fists and we're gonna rush him, even though that's. Making us super unstable. Well, maybe why? Why? Why I no swing fist? Why you no swing game? I, I'm left clicking. I want you to swing. Okay, there we go. Boom! Hey, this guy is doing some cool stuff. I'm not gonna lie. Charging up our fists might be bad. Or like charging up both fists might be bad. I mean, charging up the fists are probably just bad in general, but I'm not gonna not do it because that's madness. So we're gonna come and swing it with our small hand, All right? Link it up, and then hey, can I can I hit him with the boom? The big star fist. There you go. It's fine. It's fine. Just take the hits. Just take the hits, and then we. And we're just gonna get him. And we're just gonna, we're just gonna, just gonna get him. We're just gonna, just gonna punch him. Just gonna punch. Just gonna punch him. We didn't even hit him with our big right fist. You can see in the bottom right is our weapon system. Uh, basically, what we have is the very top thing is like our shoulder plate armor. The very back thing is I'm not really sure what it is. Oh, it's something I think that makes me tankier, right? I should probably read what my stuff does, huh? Now I'm just getting my butt kicked by Sakura Magic over here. Or Sakura Storm. Sakura Magic, that's the, the fake drug in the Great Pretender show. Sakura Magic. It's really magic. Hey, dude. So is my uh, top one actually let me charge with my shoulder pads? Because that'd be kind of dope. We got him. Pink Ranger has finally beat Sakura Storm. It only took us three matches. Or three complete. Unlocked preset. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Red Lair? You look intimidating. I wonder how many times he's gonna. I'm not locked in here with you, buddy. Ready, go. I need to just queue up that one, uh. Hey, can you. Alright, there has to be an issue. There has to be something where, when I'm overloaded, can I not swing my left hand? That has to be what was happening! Because my charged up fist probably counts as like some fancy thing. Oh no, I'm so dumb. Alright, just gonna work the body. Work the body. He killed us. Alright, we now comprehend the game better we are now better players for this loss and with that we will win i really wish i knew the the whole speech from uh whatever the gundam with the burning gloves was because that's the meme i'm trying to uh incorporate into my gameplay boom don't even come at me you want you want the side fist bop oh he hit me first with his scythe this guy thinks he's cute with his scythe. Guess what, buckaroo? Here comes my burning fist. My love, my hate, my anger. 
and whatever he says in the quote. Alright, we got it. We got this. We now understand why we were, we were, basically why we were losing at the start is we would charge up our fist for a super attack and not comprehend that the super attack for our fist was on the same meter as our booster. So we would boost and then try and do some fancy attack for, to, to no avail, essentially. Get, okay, that, okay, alright, all right, dude. All right, this guy thinks he's cute. All right, all right. We're not getting our we're not getting the hit we want in. That's all right. Now we can get our hit in, obviously, right? All right, missed with the star attack. Hello. That's all right. We transcend. And... Boom! Drop him. Drop him. We're gods. With our two fists, which are definitely like not the most optimal fighting style. Unlock Red Blair. That's how we do it. We're gonna go through Hikari Light Sunsparkle. You don't sound that intense, but you probably are way more intense than I could ever imagine. I charge in my left fist. You gotta start swinging. Start swinging your sword! I charge up my burning fist with power. I miss my star uppercut. I'm stuck in the animation. It's all right. Just get him in here. Just get him with a backswing. Get him with a side swing. He, he can't stand anything. He can't stand this. Go ahead. What do you hope to accomplish here? I'm charging both. Oh, what are you charging? Are you glitched out? Transcend power! I think when I have that flag up, it increases my melee attack speed. I'm pretty sure that's what I did. So that's what my three is. My three, that's my three is a dash. A shoulder dash. My one, boom, boom. Now I can put up these hands faster. So this guy has me against the ropes, except I'm not going to let him do that to me. Are you crazy? Charge up my fist. Oh, he dodged my super star fist. Oh, yeah, dude. He walked into the star fist, so it still counts. Where's he going? Where's he going? I lost track of myself. I guess I could also. Oh. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, he's backhand. Hit him with the laser. With a star gauntlet. This game is very fun. And I guess it came out last year, which is a surprise. Oh! That's not next match! Oh no! Alright, well, I guess we could try a. Uh, survival mode, right? That's different. And we're gonna use our champion. Which basically he's gonna play the same way as the other guy, but Drillbert is a lot more intense, looks a lot more intense. What's his achievement? I played Survival Mode for the first time. Alright, dude. Target, Mr. Surprise. What does that mean? Hey, why do you look like me? You want a piece of me? Do you see my two drills? My drills will pierce the heavens. The thing about my drills are is that they turn into hammers halfway through. The hammer swing! Because it turns into a hammer. You can see the outline of the hammer, can't you? Oh, it turned back into a drill. Drill mode activate. Unlock preset Mr. Surprise. Dude, you can't beat Drill Bird. Boom, hit him with that. Hit him with a spin. Hit him with a spin! Oh my god, the spin's too much damage. This is why Drill Bird is literally the best cha the champion of the arena. When I was playing against my buddy Aaron, even though the online multiplayer is pretty jank, that was the, the constant, is that he could not stop Drillbert's barrage. Hello? Alright. Get drilled on? Hit him with the hammer. Hit him with the hammer. You can see what form the weapons are in the bottom right. One is a hammer right now, the other is a drill. And that's, that's the fun thing about this combination. I don't know if they did that on purpose or they obviously they knew, but if you dash forward or do like a backwards, like any type of like jabbing, the drill is just a superior weapon. But then whenever you're coming from the side, you just hit them with that hammer. So realistically, you just have the best of both worlds in the melee sense. Because you stab with the drill, which does stupid damage, 
and you start spitting with a hammer. Like, what can you hope to accomplish? You baka boy. Dude, Trobert's just gonna keep winning until... And then he's on the ground, just starts spinning over his corpse. Because that's all he is now, a corpse. We're just moving through this, dude. Get out of my way, get out of my goddamn way. Oh, I was just hitting him with the old hammer. So there's like damage modifiers you can get based off of like your weapon combination and your items on your mech, obviously. So, get here with that laser. I'm not playing that laser game with you, Lux Imperia. You think Dro- uh oh. What the, what, what the hell are you? The Cosmic Gorgon? Hey, big guy. <coughs> I'm about to change my name to the Cosmic Drill just to show you that I'm the strongest thing in the skies. This is where you die, Drillbert. Drillbert, get him! True survivor, defeat at least 10. Whoa, whoa! The 89A AAM rip, rip, uh, rip, the coop, rip, zaku, whatever. Just... Oh no, I can use one of my. Oh no! I almost left the arena. That would have been so crappy. I would have been actually upset with myself. Alright, just start spinning around this guy with our hammers. What can he hope to do when he's just getting hammered on? Fly to the sky, comet smash. That's the that's my ultimate move. Is I uh, use my three and one because all my like my back and shoulder weapons are really just boosters. One boost to go up and one boost to go straight at you. So yeah, realistically, all I can do is fight you. If you were somehow able to avoid me for the whole fight, you could easily if you could control the distance at which I Drillbert fought you in, you could easily win any fight with Drillbert. But, oh my god, what's happening right now? What is happening? What, 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 Kill him, kill him. That was upsetting. Into the air, meteor shot. He, right, he's smart, he knocked me away. By smart, I mean he just knocked me away. Just drill, just, just crush this man! I'm gonna go through every single bot in this game real quick. Don't mind me. And then the spin. What can you hope to do? What can you hope to do against such power? Oh, that guy looks like some scary uh, black knight. It doesn't matter? We just keep flashing? Alright, that was the trick. Oh, no! He parried me. Whoa! Oh! We finally got beat by Yusha Jajanka. 16 matches, 16 com combats in a row. Look at Drillbert, dude. He's so intimidating, dude. I I love that mech, dude. Of course, my concept for all the mechs were like, what if I just added two melee weapons on this every single mech? These are all the mechs that beat me. I don't want to play, oh, that was an accident. What the hell? Is it me? What gun do I have? Do I have the fist? I do have the fist for this guy. What's his right click? What is what's your right click, dude? Oh, it's just a fist. Like, you don't even have a weapon, do you? I'm just taking shots to the face right now, don't mind me. I don't know if this Gordon guy is supposed to be. Shout out to Ash. I'm just gonna fist fight you midair. And then raise up my fist to destroy you. I am the gauntlet. I am the whatever Gorgon I was. You're not gonna beat me. To get slapped constantly through space and time.
Grand Doom? You're about to get the slap of a lifetime, so I'm just gonna keep spinning on you. Spin to win. And maybe give him an uppercut. Oh, no. Like, blocking everything. Alright. Alright, Ryan, dude. Oh! I think that's a good spot then. If you want to see the missions, that's what you should let me know about. I might do a video series on the missions. Uh, I, I definitely want to play this more with my friends. I got this to definitely play against my buddy Aaron. Uh, what's it called, Aaron? Oh, look, at this. look at this shit. I'm just mess around on Siegebot. It's going to be a lot harder. Siegebot has no melee weapons, only look at the right. He's a rocket based boy. Where's my opponent? Oh, yikes, he hurts. Oh, yikes, dude, you hurt. Oh, why are you so close to me? Don't stand so. Don't stand so. Don't stand so close to me. Yeah, this is gonna be a different type of playing style. I cannot. Just stay away from me. Just stay away! Just stay away from me! Yeah, so Siegebot has to win in the barrage, obviously, or he loses because he does not have any way to survive any type of combat that's not him just blowing you the fuck up. And yeah, I don't think I'm gonna try to reload my rockets in between these fights. I mean, as long as he's not approaching me, I suppose I do. What's he doing? But yeah, like, comment, subscribe, all that nonsense. Let me know what you thought about Garrison Archangel down in the comments below. Let me know if you want to face me in Garrison Archangel. I think that'd be pretty cool. I'm always down to find some opponents, but like the issue is multiplayer is kind of jank, but I'm not against it. Hey, I'm the only one with rockets here, buckaroo. Oh, we lost. That's fine. Siege by the men for a different type of gameplay. Like, comment, subscribe, all that nonsense. Arca Garrison Archangel. Uh, fifteen dollars, uh, fifteen US dollars on Steam. Developed by Indigo Entertainment, published by Indigo Entertainment. Came out May fifteenth, twenty twenty. Check it out. Let me know what you thought of the video down below. Catch you guys next time. This thing is called Riding the Bull.